Now, as many of us know, Thanksgiving, just a couple days away, if you didn't know that, uh, get ready. And one of the most amazing efforts in our community, I was blown away last year when I came out to Mobile Meals on Thanksgiving morning. It's a wonderful effort. And we have Sarah Keel in here to tell us all about Mobile Meals. Let's start with that alone and what you guys do, not just on Thanksgiving, but all year long. So Mobile Meals is Knox County's Meals on Wheels affiliate. So we deliver to around 1,100 seniors across the county wow. who are homebound, um, unable to cook for themselves and are alone during the day. And so we do this every weekday with the help of about 100 volunteers a day who deliver a hot meal, they deliver a smiling face, and they just check, check in on them, make sure they're doing okay, make sure they're safe. It really is such a needed thing, you know, and we have some video from last year's mobile meals delivery, or really the process from Thanksgiving morning, and again, the 100 volunteers, take us through that process a little bit, and why those volunteers are so important in just getting that human-to-human -human contact with some of our older adults. Absolutely, so for a lot of time, um, that volunteer they see could be the only person they see that day. So our volunteers aren't just delivering a meal, they're providing like an essential human contact, like I said, a friendly face, and also one of the most important things they do is they check in on different safety things around, around like the house. So if they see, you know, the front porch is broken or maybe they're taking longer to get to the door, um, they can report that back to us and we can address it that day, which is Some really hazards that they might even see, and that's a great point right there, and just having that human contact to smile at. It's mm -hmm. huge. That smile goes a long way. Um, volunteers, we know you guys, again, service our area all year long. Talk about your need right now. Absolutely. So we do deliver on Thanksgiving Day and on Christmas Day, which yeah. is awesome. Um, but we do have that need every single weekday of the year. So we need the, everyone's help during the holiday season. Yeah. It's a really wonderful opportunity to, to do with a family, to do with college students while they're home yeah. on break. Um, and you can do it weekly, monthly, or whenever you feel like it. You know, we accommodate all schedules. It was amazing to talk to the volunteers, you know, last year when they said, no, this is just how we always start our Thanksgiving morning. Um, so just a wonderful asset there. Is there anything that volunteers need in terms of signing up? Yeah, so it's really easy. Just call our office. Our number is 524-2786. Or you can check us out on Facebook at Knox County Mobile Meals or on our website, knoxseniors.org. Now, if I'm, you know, a family member who maybe has a senior who can maybe use signing up for this, mm -hmm. how do we cover that end of the spectrum as well? Absolutely. They can uh, also just call our office and we have a, uh, an application process and someone will come out to their home and check in on them. And it's a really straightforward process. Awesome. Sarah, thank you so much for for being here with us today. Thank you. Of course, and guys, we're gonna share all this information on mobile meals, including links to how you can volunteer or sign up, maybe an older adult in your family, all online at WATE.com. Stick with us, we'll be right back after this break with another look at your forecast.